you and Napoleon, right? Y'all both had a fight, man. Huh. And I just had Napoleon on the platform, man. That's my guy, man. Good dude, man. And he told the story from his point of view. But I want to get it from your point of view as well. So if you don't mind, man, what happened between both of y'all? So I'm going to be honest with you. So my, um, in that, you know, in that instance, for that moment in my time in my life where I was, I, you know, um, you know, me and Dalvin, that's like one of my best friends, Dalvin from Jodeci. So we wasn't necessarily, I, I, I necessarily wasn't with Jodeci, you know what I'm saying? I, Casey and JoJo were my guys, you know what I mean? But I, Dalvin was my best friend. Still my uh, one of my dearest friends to this day, right? So Dalvin's like a, you know, he, you know, he he a ladies man, you know what I'm saying? He like he love, you know, hey, he, he love the women. So so I for some reason, I he didn't ran across the you know, him and Muta, they 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 kind of like Dylan smashing the, the same girl, you know what I mean? I don't know what's going on. So they this don't have nothing to do with me at all. So so, so the, uh, I don't know if Mutar got his phone number. I don't know what, I don't know the full parameters. I don't know what happened, but they had words on the phone. So when I, you know, when I see you, it's on. Had that same energy. Woo, woo, whatever, whatever, woo, woo, woo. So for some strange reason, you know how, you, you, you may have to just run into a motherfucker. Sometimes you just run into motherfuckers. I, for some strange reason, they ran into each other. So. I'm minding my own business. I'm asleep. I'm, I, I think I'm boiling me some top ramen noodles. I'm minding my own business. Three minutes to make the top ramen. I'm chilling. No, I don't want no problem. I'm chilling. My phone go up. I'm like, hello. What up, T? It's Dalvin. I'm like, he's like, he like, uh, where you at? I said, I'm at the house chilling. He said, he said, he said uh, I'm at the liquor store. I said, cool. That's that's what you what you you know what you what you what you doing at the liquor store? He said, I'm just getting something to drink. But I, but it's something, it's, I, it's somebody up here. And I'm like, okay, who up there? He's like, man, the dude I got in, the, the dude from the outlaw, you know, the, he, you know, he out, he outside. I'm like, okay, he outside. That's great. What, what, what does that mean? So then he's like, you know, we, you know, we had words. Away. I'm like, okay, man, look, I'm on my way. So. I put on my, I, I, I unboil my top ramen noodles. I, t I turned the fire off. <laughs> he and got me out of my, <laughs> I turned my fire off. You know what I mean? So now I got to go up the, I, I drive up the hill. You know what I'm saying? I go, to, I go inside the liquor store. You know what I'm saying? I see Dalvin in the liquor store. I see Muta on the outside of the liquor store in a red Lexus. I'm not making nothing up when I talk all fact. So I see him in a red Lexus. I go in the store, I see Dalvin in the store, Chinese person on the side, uh, you know, the hurry up and buy, you know, he, I don't know what, Dalvin's right there at the, at, the, at the register. I'm like, you ready? Let's go. So I see Dal, we walk out, you know, Dal ain't no buster or nothing like that, but you just never know what, what's going on, cars, people have, you don't know what's in the car, all that kind of stuff. So I'm kind of familiar with this kind of world. I'm like, man, let me, let me just make sure my, 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 my best friend, my people cool. So we, we come out the liquor store and I see Muta, you know what I mean? I'm, I, I have my own little way of looking at a nigga when I see somebody, you know what I mean? Like, I, it, ain't, it ain't like that. It, you know, nigga, I'm that nigga too. You know, it ain't like that. You feel me? So we jump in. I follow Dalvin. We go to the studio. I didn't know that Muta was going to the same studio Dalvin going to. I, I, had, I, didn't, I didn't know that. So we get there and we walk in. Me, Dalvin, and then Muta, I guess he walking or whatever, and I just hear somebody say, I don't give a fuck about all that shit, nigga. Fuck all that. This ain't no movie shit. This ain't no, this ain't no, anybody can get, anybody can get it. I'm like, damn, anybody can get it. I, I, that mean me. I'm, I'm, I, I, you feel me? So the way I see it, this is the way I see it. Once he say that, I turn around and I, I do what I'm supposed, I feel like I did what I, you know what I mean? I did me. So then at that point, I, I feel like I took off and then they was like, no, nah, no, nah, let's go in the street. Cause I'm just, where I come from, I just feel like, man, like it's a problem. I just want to, I, I want to take off. Like that's just, it, we know it's something I'm taking off. You know what I mean? So we go in the middle of the street, you know, we got a, it's kind of like a crowd. 
crowd, you know what I mean? So we get in the middle of the street and we get down. You know what I mean? We get down. I do my thing the way I do it. For, and from, for, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I can, I, I feel like I can fight. I'm not going to say I want to lose, but I'm going to tell the world this. I can actually fight. I can fight. So I, in my own way, I, I was fighting. And I was doing a good job at what I was doing. I did all I could take. I, I did. I, I did my job for myself. So when the gun fall out, I see the gun, and then um, it it, it threw my energy off because I'm like, damn, this is, this could be this 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 could go all bad now because this is this is different. There's a pistol involved and shit. I'm like, hold on, man. I I just want to I just want to get out and squab like ah oh, hey the, the gunplay like it you know what I mean but. He tossed the gun, like, I'm like, I don't know how the gun got to my boy, to Doc, but the the the, uh, the gun got to Doc. I'm still got energy. Muta kind of like, you know, I seen that it was kind of like, this is where it need to end. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it was kind of like, nah, I'm, I, I, I'm good. You know? And um, I think it was a situation to what, what I seen was like, You got to be prepared. Like, like when someone says, I don't drink or all that, because I'm never going to drink. I'm never going to smoke. So I'm going to always be prepared for, for a situation. Not that I want it, but, you know, I don't think he was necessarily, he underestimated the situation and wasn't probably in his mind prepared the way he felt like he needed to be prepared in his own mind. Right? But I will say to this, there's no, there was no uh, winner in that situation, a fight, whatever. That's, that's the, whatever. The, the, the winner was that me and him fought like men. The winner was that no one was a, no one was a sore loser. Um, and um, when his people came up there, they, they came, all I heard was car doors, <laughs> dump, car doors and all kind of, I look on the side, Dalvin in the car, Dalvin like, T, let's go. I'm like, no, nah, hold. I, I, I trust my feet. I run. I, I trust my feet. I say, I'm not getting no car. I'm not gonna sit inside of a car and niggas gonna dump me out. I don't do that kind of stuff. So I'm trusting my feet. I'm like, let me figure out where dude is. Is he gonna keep it real and say we just took the fade head up or what's gonna happen before I make my next move? But I'm willing to deal with it. I'm willing to deal with what I gotta deal with. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm in it. There's nothing to do. But I'm not jumping in the car because you're not gonna dump me out. That's not happening. So Muta was like. Nah, we went head up. We went fair, nah. It was, it was a head up, man. We, it was fair and square. Like I, I can, you know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't, I don't want to say, I don't want to say lost. I don't like. That's not. I didn't, I didn't come here to say lost. You know what I mean? I'm just saying that I did what I had to do, and he was a man about what happened. That's all I can tell you. And I respect him. And he could have pushed the line and made it a lot more worse. That's what I'm saying. And he didn't do that. And that's why I really want to get a win to him because it, if he would have took, yeah, I got, I give the win to him because he could have took it to another level with the people that he was with, and and we probably wouldn't have had this interview. So I, you said you wanted a, a lose, a winner, a loser. He get the win. 